So a beautiful day in the world means another beautiful day for culture. Anthem Culture, Culture News today. We're here at Anthem Culture headquarters currently doing a lot of browsing online, getting a lot of news and updates from around the world, even some new um, article submissions. So be on the lookout throughout the next week for some exciting articles coming up. So we're about to check out the site. A lot of new things went up for today. Been doing a lot of work on the website as far as like the culture pages and really cater to everybody that's coming to visit those. Check those out. So yeah, make sure you stay tuned to anthemculture.com. And without further ado, let's get into the story. See what we have new for today. So you kind of could tell like the direction that the music industry is moving into with the arrival of so many music festivals now around the world, even popping up in new destinations. One of which for this upcoming summer is Croatia. Croatia, I actually seen the list is a huge lineup of just festivals ranging from different types of music, different locations around Croatia, and pretty much just scale, different sizes. So all of these festivals, I'm sure you could find somebody that you're interested in. And it really just showcases the fact that not only can you enjoy the music, but now bringing on these festivals, you could be amongst a lot of music lovers and festival lovers and just uh, overall experience so make sure you read more about that on anthemculture.com and stay updated on what you could see, expect out in croatia so islamic art is on display at the buckingshire county museum out in the uk and it's actually a huge collection of islamic art those of you who are familiar with the museum know it's not one of the grandest museums when we talk about museums around the world but actually people are now saying that the Islamic art exhibit that they're holding is actually one of the biggest art exhibits for Islam art. So that's definitely a cool thing. You get to see artwork, paintings, sculptures, even the largest Quran collection at the museum. So that's very cool. So make sure you check more about that and even stay tuned to the overall Islamic uh, festival running for a couple weeks, couple months. So make sure you read more about that on anthropoculture.com. So globalization affects every single industry. This story we have on anthropoculture.com is about how it affects the film industry. Out in Bollywood is huge in itself, but now film studios are coming from Bollywood into Hollywood to actually record various pieces. And there's a film called Say Rat, which is an Indian film, came over to Hollywood to record their, the score for the film. Worked with very influential composers in the um, film industry when it comes to scoring and even being a part of um, famous studios by Sony to record, score the music and really just to get a new perspective, a new outlook on the type of music that you could see in various films and bring in a new dynamic to Indian films. So make sure you be on the lookout for that story on anthropoculture.com and for that film too. It should be a great one. So as I said before, music festivals are popping up everywhere. I came across this story on anthemculture.com recently called the Boston Calling Music Festival. And at first it was a sense of deja vu till I just found out that it's held twice a year. So the first one for 2016 is actually coming up very soon. And it's an amazing lineup of just artists that you can experience ranging different genres from R&B, pop music, even full-blown bands. It's headlined by Sia. So you could check more about that, even see the poster, the full lineup, and even the whole itinerary schedule for that music festival on anthemculture.com. Check that out if you're in the New England area. It's definitely one for you guys. <laughs> Those of you who are fans of ballet and the overall dance world, might have heard about the Bolshoi Ballet Academy, which is in Moscow actually. It's an exclusive dance academy pretty much that brings to light very amazing dancers from around the world and a lot of people actually structure their life around trying to get into this academy because it's so exclusive and just the connects and experience that you get just by going through it, it pretty much opens up opportunities everywhere for you. So, no wonder you see a lot of people going through so much just to apply, showcasing their talents just to get into it and participate. So yeah, you can read more about pretty much the behind the scenes of this academy on anthemculture.com. It's a very cool article. <laughs> Culture news all the time, news and information from around the world. 
anthemculture.com. You can check it all there. Check out the news section. Check out the explore section. Browse a country of your interest. Get all the information that you could ever want from it. And continuously be updated. So stay tuned. Make sure you continue to check out anthemculture.com. Shout out to everybody that subscribed to the newsletter. All of the new subscribers checking out these videos. What's up? <laughs> Welcome to the entertainment. <laughs> But yeah, continue to tell friends to subscribe to the newsletter videos, trying to put out great content, keep you guys updated about culture around the world, staying updated. So make sure you continue to follow along with everything we have going on here at Anthem Culture. It's a lot of upcoming projects, whether becoming nicer, spending a lot of time out and about hitting various events, uh, various shoots, videos, everything like that. So we got a lot of things in the works for you guys. So stay updated, anthemculture.com. Shout out to all the culture heads. Appreciate culture.